Cooking fire. Select a cooker brew, then choose the item and craft the item. So I'm picking up the provisioning skill line now. This doesn't mean that I can do the master ritz yet, but it does mean that I can make things. Now I picked up that recipe earlier, so I can craft it. Ta-da! Craft it. Okay. Now most um, thieves areas do have two. Do we have a merchant? Oh my gosh, there is a guild trader in here. Your money is my business. Okay, guild traders are, um, if people want to sell things to other people, then it's here in the bank. So, say that I wanted a Nernhund, I don't know, weapon, say a destruction staff. I can search for it and, uh, Okay, I searched all traits and standard loot. Okay, there we go. It's expensive, but it exists. Okay. But, um, say I wanted, uh... Uh, say I wanted the, uh, Greymore crafting motif. I can type in Grey, and it brings up a list of things. So, say I didn't already have the chest, I could search for that. And there we go. People are selling it <laughs> for not much. Okay. Um, I will no longer be attacked by the law. That's amazing. All right, I will actually pay the money for her to clear my bounty. But um, there we go. You bring it, I buy it, and I'm not picky on what. Oh. Okay, I am now upstanding. I could have just like waited an hour or two and it would have cleared itself. Or if I had gotten a um a counterfeit pardon edict out of a um thief strove, then I could have signed it myself and then cleared my bounty for free instantly. Alright. But I'm gonna take you upstairs. Okay. Now um sometimes uh when you get to level like 15 or 20 and you go in there, you're going to find a woman named Quinn and another woman who are going to offer to induct you into the Dark Brotherhood and the Thieves Guild. Very fun, but we're not high enough level yet, so that is not going to be available to us. Okay, we also can't do the Master Ritz yet, but we can acquire a skill light. See, we just inquired enchanting just by going into the crafting uh, center, going to the enchanting table, and clicking on it. Now, I do have a truly superb glyph of flame for some reason. So, I can extract it, and my enchanting skills just went up measurably. Alright. Um. Alright. Alchemy station. I've just gained alchemy. Now, um, I can make things as long as I already have the thing, so if you have natural water, and let's see, uh, columbine, and let's see, mountain flower, then you can make yourself a health potion. And this one is also going to give me stamina. Now, if I went to my skill line down here, and clicked on alchemy, and I clicked laboratory use, that would open up one more. And then I could add something onto it, say... Where is it? I don't think it's going to be with Mountain Flower. Bogloss, maybe? There we go. And then I could have Magicka. So, if I have Columbine, Columbine Mountain Flower, and Bogloss, I can make myself a potion that will increase my health, my magicka, and my stamina, all at the same time. And, and because um, I picked those specific ones, it will also increase my health recovery, my magicka recovery, and my stamina, which means that I'm going to heal faster and get all my things back faster. Now upstairs we do also have a bank. Uh, let's see. Card sharps and collectors. 
Test your wits and courage if you want to play a card game, card game, you can play your card tribute. game there. We also have a merchant up here. We have a blacksmithing station over here. Skill line gains. And, uh, thank you. Okay, I can include the um, banked items, so I can research any of these I want, or... There we go. Click the research over here. Go to the battle axe. And I could uh, research that right now. But I don't want to. Okay. Anything else I can research? A good old... No, okay. Or I can uh, not include banked items. Find the uh, level 2 curse, which are now under leveled. And you can see uh, the little bag sign by the 1. That means it's in my bag. If there was a chest by it, you would see that it was a chest. If I was currently wearing it, then you would see a symbol on it that says, You're wearing it. Don't take it apart. Okay. So there we go. Blacksmithing has a. Oh, Alright. There was nothing usable in it, but uh. That's fun. Okay. Woodworking. Thank you very much. Okay. Oh, and I can research the Forgotten Inferno stuff. Or the bow. There we go. It's chaining. They're both training, so I'm gonna take apart the bow, or research the bow, click on it, research trait, and there we go. I'm researching. And then I'm going to deconstruct the lightning stuff. There we go. Woodworking brought up. Alright. Skilling the clothing. Alright. Now, it's really nice and fun to be able to make your own equipment. And when you learn how to do the Master Ritz, I uh, did a bot on these, I'm going to do a video on another day. Then you can uh, go to these boards over here, pick up the Ritz, and make some money off of it. But if you don't want to do that, then you can go to a crafting center. I don't have any of those on the map right now, but you can go to a crafting center anywhere and make some special armor. 